Hey, what's up guys? Today is Saturday, the day of the Hollywood Art Walk. It is my first Hollywood Art Walk. Um, I am just getting my trunk packed right now. Don't ask me why I have so much stuff. I don't know why. Um, I, I think most vendors don't have this much stuff. Not sure, it's kind of ridiculous. Uh, I'm just selling art prints. I don't know why I have so, so much. Why well, I have shirts and then hangers and electrical stuff and uh, it just accumulates, I guess. It's kind of heavy, but uh, yeah, uh, it's my first time vlogging like a local kind of craft art show. Usually I just do conventions, so uh, we'll see how this one goes. See you. All right, so dealing with the uh, headache of doing an event for the first time, we got to find out parking, uh, where to go, yada yada. This event is not at a particular location, it's in like the middle of the street and they're blocking off. Uh, the streets. Um, so it's a little scary right now, trying to figure things out. But talk to the police officer, and I think I'm figuring it out. So I'll check in with you later. All right, so just parked. Parking is two blocks over from where the actual event is, which is interesting. It shows that it's showing me that I'm getting excited for the event because it's telling me that this is kind of big that I have to park all the way over there. And um, I was just talking to a vendor who parked right next to me, or I parked right next to her, and um, she was saying there's a lot more vendors here today. It's usually not this busy. I'm guessing because uh, Christmas is around the corner. Um, so maybe that's it, I don't know. Got all my stuff, got all my stuff in the sidewalk. Just as soon as these guys move their car, I can start setting up. Let me go to the street. So this is the event before it starts. We got a street here and all the vendors are set up, split down the middle. Let's see what it looks like when the event starts. guys so this is the final look this is a different setup I've never set up this grid display like this like box like that that's something I thought of on the fly but it's pretty cool I did that just so it's like 360 art so people can see it from far away they, got a sta they built a stage over there playing music and as I was setting up, I already sold someone, some kid bought three prints, all Spider-Man, so made 15 bucks so far. Let's see how the night goes. What a great start so far. Um, it's 6.27, the event started at 6. I did sell something right before 6 o'clock, but I made $68 so far, and uh, the event ends at 11. I haven't made my table back yet, but 27, in, 27 minutes into the event, so that's a, probably my best start ever at any event. <laughs> so, pretty cool, hope it continues, fingers crossed. All right, so I'm deciding to go all out on this event. So I'm doing stuff I've never done before. So what I got here is these magnets and I'm attaching them to the prints front and, and back. And I'm just plopping them up on my tent and they're hanging. I'm trying to grab people's attention. We're getting a lot of love, people stopping by, checking out the art. Not everyone's buying, but that's okay. I do appreciate uh, admiration. So thanks everyone who's doing that. I'm at about $82 right now, I think. Um, and yeah, let's keep it going. All right, so I'm at 107 bucks, uh, which is awesome. 
doing doing pretty well. At least I made my table back and I'm not losing money, so that's a plus. That's a di big difference. Then uh, how these events usually go. Uh, my battery pack here is at 6%. So in a short amount of time, all my lights are gonna shut off. So I need to go to the car and get an extension cord because they have power here. Luckily they're offering power, but I have to run a couple blocks over and get my cable. I, I should have brought it. And um, it's just every time I try to leave, people come to the tent, which is a good problem to have, but I gotta escape here quick, very quickly. All right, I put my B back in five minutes sign up. Um, getting my cable right now, my extension cord. These, uh, it's Saturday night, man. This uh, Hollywood Boulevard is popping. Uh, um, I had to pass a couple other blocks and there's like good break dancing and restaurants are popping and music going. So it's really, really lively right now. There's people on the other blocks from the block I'm on. So hopefully they come on by. Boom, got the extension cord hooked up to the slide box. Hey, so I'm at 168 for the night so far, which is better than I do at all conventions in a day, usually. So it's really good for once and making some money at an event. It's, not, it's usually not like that, so I guess the setup's good and crowd's good. The odds are in my favor tonight. Two more hours left of the event, so we'll see if it keeps going. I forgot my chair, so I've been standing up most of the time. Sometimes I'll sit on this curve, curve here, but people keep something by, so I can really get up, which is a good problem to have, but my feet and back are killing me, per usual. They have mostly jewelry here, like these vendors are selling jewelry, pretty much everyone. I think I'm the only one selling. No, I walk by. I am the only one selling art prints. I, I'm the only one selling art. So uh, that's great. I'm sticking out. So I'm the only one fan art. Characters that people love. Unlike a comic convention where I don't stick out at all. So it's a nice change. Alright, so a lot of the art can't fit into my. Uh, okay, so a lot of the art can't fit into my portfolio. So I have to keep a lot of it on the side and hidden. And, um. I was clearing space for the portfolio and I threw uh, my Killer Croc in there and immediately it sells, which, which I've never, never sold a Killer Croc before. So, things are going my way tonight. I'm at 210 right now in total, so let's keep it going. other vendors were wondering why it, they extended it to 11 p.m. because uh, it was completely dead like no traffic at all so. really dead in my back because I didn't bring a chair because <laughs> I forgot so yeah my feet hurt and back hurt but um, I made 250 all together the table the spot was 70 so it's at 180 I don't know, man. It was five, it was six to eleven. That's five hours. Five hours of work for one hundred eighty dollars. I mean, it's a, it's a lot of effort, man. Just 
setting up and packing and loading up the car, unloading, doing a little uh, this vendor game. If if you make a living off of this, like I don't know how. I really don't. And I feel for, I feel for you because usually it's bad bad nights, bad days where you don't make money. Um, I'm signed up for a few more shows within these next two months because it's right before Christmas so I tried loading up and uh, taking advantage of the holidays but um yeah it's a it, it's a, it can be a depressing depressing game this this vendor business but all around for my first Hollywood art walk it went well uh, I was the only one person there with fan art I was the only person selling art prints so uh, I think that's why I did did better than the other vendors or most of the other vendors I'm signed up for a Hollywood Art Walk next month so I'll be doing it again hopefully I do even better if I were to make 180 every time I did this I probably wouldn't do it because that's really not a lot of money man I mean what are you going to do with that you can buy groceries for the, for a week or two and that's, I mean, that's something it's so much easier as an artist just to do commissions in your room, da da da. You're not breaking your feet and back and loading and unloading and and sitting there being bored, uh, waiting for people to buy and ch you have to be a salesman and be all peppy and stuff. It's so much easier just to do commissions. All right, I'm gonna sign out. Um, thank you for watching. If you watched it, appreciate you guys. Please like. And if you're not subbed, sub, follow wherever you're watching this. And, uh, until next time, guys. And I'm out.